Good morning, everyone. Right now in Lakeview, it's 9.49 a.m. on Friday, December 18th. There really isn't any news to speak of today. Uh, okay, bye, Isabel. <laughs> well, well, well. What do we have here, ladies and gentlemen? We have snow in December. And I'm so excited about it. <laughs> Um, I really just wanted to travel to December today and maybe hopefully catch some balloons with DIYs and decorate a little more for Christmas and just have a grand old time. So, um, <laughs> I changed my outfit and I kind of want to change it back to something more wintry since I went through all this trouble of time traveling. Um, also, I, I'm i not going to lie about it. I have been time traveling a lot to December <laughs> to try to get some DIYs for Christmas so that I can start decorating and I don't have to wait until the day of Christmas to make my island look Christmassy like they always make us do. Um, so I have been kind of cheating a little bit. <laughs> I mean, it's not cheating, but I have been time traveling a little bit, but I really haven't been able to get that many DIYs and it has been kind of frustrating. Um, I've only gotten a few and I just recently got the, whatchamacallit, the giant tree and that's really the only one that I've gotten that's been like that's wowed me. So I don't know, kind of frustrating, I guess, but that's okay. Why do I have three Jack's robes? What? Okay. Anyway, um, Ooh, I should wear a hat. That's very cute. Or a bow. That's very cute. Or a beanie. Wow. I have so many options. This one. Oh my word, I don't have shoes on. Hang on. <laughs> and I'm not walking out barefoot in the snow. Okay, that's not what's going to happen today. That's not what's going to happen. Um, I should probably put on socks because it's cold out. And then I'll wear these little booties. That's very cute. Alright, so let's see what's going on. I can show you guys what I've been working on a little bit. Uh, I've worked on my entrance some. So this is what I have. I moved Nook's back a little bit to match up with Abel's. I changed my pathing, uh, obviously. So I put this path down and I was, okay, I did find a path. Let me show you guys. I'm just gonna get this started now. Oh, I'm gonna lose my hat though, that's sad. Oh well. Okay, so I did find a pattern like of the path that looked that was like bricks that I, I I liked but I decided to go okay I only have two of them left but this is what the brick one looked like that I was going to use but then I decided to just go with the uh, classic paths that the game comes with because I think that that gives off more of a city vibe and it's just like I don't want to say it's harsher, but it's just more like uniform, obviously. Um, so, and since we're going, you know, for like Chicago themed, I thought I would do actual sidewalks. I do have this other design. You probably saw it. So this little number you put down on top of it. Oh, hang on. <laughs> okay. Yeah. Uh, wait, what? I'm so confused. Wait, why is this not working? Okay, there we go. What? Okay. <laughs> you put down. And look at it. It makes it look kind of more... Uh, I wouldn't say ma not natural, maybe. But just... Um, I don't know. I kind of like it. I think it adds a little bit of pizzazz to this pathway but I'm not sure if I'm going to use it yet so I think I'm just gonna do a section with it and see what it looks like and then uh, and then we will see 
Okay, I am not very good at this. This is not... Is this the one I want then? Do I want to put it up here? No. I am so confused right now. Hang on. I, I'll figure this out. Ooh, 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 there's a, there's a balloon. I really am hoping that it is a DIY. Like I said, I just got that giant tree DIY that you see in the back there. And so I had to make one, of course, and I love it so much. Okay, please be a DIY, please be a DIY, please. Okay, well, <laughs> anyway. So yes, I don't know if I'm going to use this border, but I think it's a good idea. Uh, I will definitely think about it. Keep it in the back of my mind. And then as far as, I don't know, as far as other stuff goes, like, decorating stuff like something here like putting something here and then putting something over here like i don't know what i want to do i just think i need to clean up a little bit because i think it's throwing me off this is not gonna stay like this i don't know what to do <laughs> uh, i thought i had more of a vision i guess for what i wanted to do i'm gonna put this bush right here though while i'm at it so while i'm doing this let's talk a little bit let's chat let me know how your guys's thanksgiving was mine was good i just spent it with family and loved ones it was super chill nothing crazy happened um but let me know how you guys spent it and how it was i would love to know obviously things were different this year but I think we have been making the best out of things and that's all that matters so like I said let me know how your guys's Thanksgiving was I was going to record a turkey day celebration but I honestly forgot about it <laughs> so I had to go back on my own and play it like three days later um and by that point I was like you know it's not even it's not even worth it. <laughs> so, um, it was fun though. I liked the Turkey Day event. Um, let me know if you guys liked it. I thought it was really cute. Like, look at all of this area that we have right here. Like, I don't know what to do with it. Maybe we could put, um, like a little cafe or like, a, like in Chicago, they have a lot of restaurants have like igloos outside where you can eat and stuff so i'm thinking as i collect more diys i will put a cafe area out here a restaurant type thing where if i have guests over people can come and eat and they won't get cold i can put some like fireplaces out and such i think that would be really cute and then over here i'm not quite sure what i want to do i'll probably just put like random decorations like I don't know it's it's kind of an awkward space but that's okay um, and then I need to kind of spruce this up a little bit change it to more Christmas themed not really sure how I'm gonna do that either but we'll figure it out all right let's go see what else is going on on the island haven't gotten anything done yet <laughs> I've been recording for 20 minutes so that's great okay you know what I'm actually gonna get started on I wanted to make a tree farm Christmas tree farm so that's what I'm gonna get started on I've been seeing a bunch of other people do this as well so I think I'm just gonna join in on the fun and plant some myself um i think i'm gonna use country fencing so i actually need to make some oh another update for my island too zucker has grasped on like a leech he will not leave i'm pretty sure everyone else has had a thought bubble except zucker so that's fine but we will just continue to wait and when he's ready he's ready and then we'll film a villager hunt so be on the lookout for that, I guess, at some point. Okay, so I don't know where I want to put the tree farm. I'm thinking like right here, honestly, so that it's close to everything. Or I could put it back here in the back part of my island so that it's more in the woodsy, nature-y area. I don't really like this part of my island. It's like 
weird. I should have planned this better. I just don't know. I kind of want to put a bridge over here. Like crossing over here. And then we could put the tree farm like right here. Yeah, is that is that a good idea? Like on the river? That would actually be kind of cute, I think. So I need a bridge. I also kind of want to terraform this because I don't want it to be this big. There's so much going on right now. Hang on. These flowers have got to go. Absolutely, they cannot stay here. Because I kind of want like my plaza to be the center point of my island, obviously. And then everything kind of branch out from there. So like I have the main shopping district right in the front. And then I was thinking you come back here, you know, go to the plaza, do whatever you got to do. And then you can take a right over the over the uh, river and then go to a Christmas tree farm and pick out your Christmas tree. I think that would be kind of cute. Just need to figure out the logistics of everything. So if this is in the middle, oh, ooh, ooh, there's another balloon. I hope this is a friggin DIY and not a microphone. That kind of made me mad. I'm not gonna lie about it. Oops, let's swap it real quick. Okay, is that not so annoying though, you guys? Like we literally have waited, uh, well, I've waited all year for the Christmas decorations. You can only get them in balloons. You can't even get them from your villagers. And then they put other, other crap in the balloons too. Like that, like that's so annoying, whatever. What ever. I'm just gonna clean all of this stuff up. So is this in the middle or what? Because, oops. That looks like this can't be in the middle. I, I mean, I guess that is. So let me see. This is one, two, three, four, five flowers. And this is one, two, three, four, yeah. It is going to be off center, but that's fine. Oh, wait. Is it centered? Am I stupid? Hang on. I'm so... Oh my gosh, you guys. What is wrong with me? Okay, one, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. Ooh, okay, it's centered. It's centered. I'm just stupid. <laughs> I am just not with it today. Don't know what's wrong with me, don't ask. Let's just keep it moving. Let's just keep it moving, okay? So this is where the bridge will be. Like that, that's very cute. All right, so when I'm thinking of a Christmas tree farm, and I'm thinking we're out in the country, we are in the forest, so, I'm thinking maybe that one's really cute. I think that one would match well. Or the suspension bridge. Mm. I just don't like how this one doesn't have handrails. <laughs> and I know that's like such a stupid thing to, to like restrain me from getting it, but I don't know. But I think it's gonna look the best. So I guess I'll pick it. For the most part, I am trying to keep my rivers how they came originally just because that's way easier than you know trying to redo the whole thing so <gasps> yes that looks so good what if i put the christmas tree farm on an incline like on a hill i think that would be kind of cute but that's also a lot more work and i don't know if i'm cut out for it <laughs> So, okay, I just had an I had another idea. I'm just so creative. I don't know what's gotten into me. <laughs> but um, maybe we could do like I know this isn't super Christmassy. This is more like fall, but we could do a little sitting area with apple cider and hot chocolate and then have an incline going up to the Christmas tree farm or we could do it vice versa. Have the Christmas tree farm down here and then you walk up the hill and it's like um a little hot chocolate stand mm, i don't know i don't know 
I do know that I'm going to need to cut these trees down though. So let me start on that. Let me know what you guys think I should do. I don't know. Because I don't want it to just be the Christmas tree farm. I want it to be kind of... Okay. I literally hate my life right now. I hate my life. Jeez, that was so close. Oh my gosh. Why? Okay, whatever. Well, since I'm here at Nook's Cranny, I will buy some medicine, I guess. Jeez. I had seven things of medicine in my bag. And I just bought one more. Okay. <laughs> this is a disaster. I might have to like look at some other people's stuff a little more too to get some inspiration. Because I, I have the idea and I know a lot of other people do too. I just have to figure out how to execute it. Which is usually my biggest issue is trying to actually execute my ideas. So I need to plant some cedar trees and i'm gonna have to remember to oops it's not where i wanted that okay well that's where it's staying <laughs> i'm going to need to remember to check on them so that they don't start growing to normal size because you can put another tree behind it and it'll stop its growth so it'll be like a super cute little Christmas tree. I'm sure you guys have seen pictures of that. It's going all over the internet. A lot of people are doing it. We'll come back to this. I actually, I'm gonna time travel one day and we will come back to it, but I'm gonna go pay off my bridge first too so that it will be just done and out of the way. Okay, so it's the next day and oh i already see them look at all those little christmas trees so cute our bridge is done it looks amazing wow i love it okay so if you don't know the trees have four different cycles that they grow into so this one is one of them obviously and i think i'm actually going to keep a couple of them this tiny so i'm going to pick up let's see i'll do like two of them this small the rest of them i'll let continue to grow for one more day and then we'll come back and we'll do it all over again okay so it's the next next day and we have another size christmas tree waiting for us i love this height as well so i think i'm going to save like two or three of them at this height too i just need to free up some space in my pocket and then we will go to the next 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 day and see the final product before they grow to their last big giant stage <gasps> Ooh, it's snowing out <gasps> look at maple she's so cute oh my gosh i'm so excited okay folks here we go oh oh i forgot i left stuff at the drop box <laughs> okay so here we are the final day let's go see what these trees look like and here they are <laughs> so this is what they look like very cute i don't know if i have to have fruit to pick them up I do, okay. So I need to free up some space too in my inventory and then I'm gonna pick these ones up. Okay, cool. So I have all of the different sizes of trees that I wanna use and I'm super excited to get going on this. Um, I think that's going to be a video for a different day. I'm so sorry for the cliffhanger, but I promise I won't work on it myself. I'll wait to work on it with you guys, and I should be able to get that video up relatively shortly because I didn't say this at the beginning of the video, but I haven't filmed in like a week or two weeks because I was finishing up school at the beginning of last week, and then Thanksgiving happened, and so I was just hanging out with family a lot. So I haven't really recorded in a while, but now that school is over and the holiday is over, I will definitely be able to get more content out, which I'm super stoked about. So I think that's where I'm gonna end the video. 
I don't want to get started on this and then not finish it, you know what I mean? So we'll, we'll save that for the next video. That will definitely be the next video. I promise. Oh, look at Tucker. He's so cute, you guys. He looks so cute in the snow. Like, he's meant to be here right now. I love it. I don't know if I want to use this design or not. Let me know what you guys think of this, because I think it adds something really cute to the sidewalk, but I'm not sure. I also kind of just like the sidewalk how it is, so I don't know. Let me know. <laughs> but anyway, oh, there's a balloon up there. Oh my word. Wow. I would have been so mad if I didn't see that. Of course, it's a digital scale, because what else would it be? Thank you, Nintendo, for that. Uh, but anyway, I need to get off of here before I get too heated about this. So, <laughs> I feel like we accomplished not a lot in this video, but I do need your guys' help on, on some things. So, let me know what you think of this little design here, what I should do, if I should use it or not. Let me know also what you think of the tree farm idea because I, for one, love it. I just don't know how to execute it. So if you have any suggestions, please leave them below. I would love to, to read them and gather some inspiration from you guys. But look at this view right now. I love it. Ugh. Okay, well... That's where I'm going to end the video. If you watched it this far into it, thank you so much for watching. If you enjoyed it, please give it a like and you can subscribe if you so please. And I hope to see you again very soon. Bye!